Okay, Yargar's taken care of. Mm-hmm. Any thoughts? I'm thinking this is a nice inn. It is. Okay, I need you to do something. You have my full attention. I need you to just relax around here for a while, okay? I'm gonna be going somewhere. I don't want to say where in case we were followed. Um, but I want everyone to think I'm still here. That guy walked right, like, close behind me. Okay, come and get me when it is time to go. Okay. Mm, I have to be careful. Hello? Oh! Well, holy crap! So did not realize Cicero was alive. E oh, <laughs> there they are! <laughs> oh, look at that! <laughs> Cicero? <laughs> Hello! How's it going? Howdy, Z. Welcome back. <laughs> Nazir, this one will get to your thing shortly, but before that, uh, Maven would like a word with the listener here. Maven Blackbriar? You don't know any other Mavens in Skyrim? No. What's she want with me? Here, she asked me to bring you this letter. Me specifically, or...? Not just whoever is in charge of the Brotherhood now. That's concerning. Alright, let's see what she wants. To the new leader of the Dark Brotherhood. We haven't yet had the pleasure of being properly introduced. I do hope your new methods are more reliable than whatever Astrid was doing. Shame to hear of her passing, but I'm open to new ventures. Perhaps lucrative ones, should you comply with a simple request to send our darling courier back to me with a response. I even have a contract lined up for you. Astrid owed me an assassination, and I would be very unhappy if her successor didn't follow up on it. While my original proposal has been dealt with, I do have a more personal target. Suitable of someone with your talents, perhaps. You would have to be very good indeed to find the person who killed my son and daughter. I do hope to hear from you soon. Maven Blackbriar, Jarl of Riften. <laughs> Jarl of Riften. So that's how Kinoa did it. Ah, uh, what is that face for? It's a little creepy. She has no idea who she's dealing with. Nazir, you're our speaker. And you know what it was like working with Astrid and presumably Maven. Thoughts? I think it's best we just forget this ever happened and move on, hmm? Not concerned about the potential loss of a wealthy client. Will there ever come a time when the people of Skyrim no longer need our services? I think not. Glad to see we're on the same page. <laughs> a vindictive listener is a scary thing indeed. I don't know about vindictive, but if she doesn't fear us, she really has no idea who she's up against. If she didn't fear us, she wouldn't be trying so hard to get back into contact. She may be the Jarl of Riften, but she's still on the Stormcloak side of Skyrim. Methinks she's beginning to feel the winds of change. I take it the Thieves' Guild is sliding slowly out of her grasp. Mm hmm The more we stand on our own feet, the less we need her. And she knows it. That's my girl. Alright, if you would, give this response to a courier on your way back. That was quick. Why a random courier? I don't want you anywhere near Maven when she reads it. You weren't followed, were you? If I was, I made sure to lose them. That's why I kept Inigo and Shadowmere behind me when I did my last job. This one suspects people find Inigo before they find tiny little Kashit. If I did my job right, anyone following me would be very confused right about now, since my companion and horse still have not left the city. If Maven wants to learn where this place is, she will have to try harder than that. Well done, Z. And... Yes. Yes, she will. 
Ooh, that's a scary face. That's the face you made when you told me not to kill him on. You, uh, you did kill him, right? This one kind of promised the Emperor she'd get someone to do it. I did. Nazir, I'd like you and Babette to keep an eye on our newest trainee. Make sure she isn't sneaking off or sending any letters. Uh oh, why is she suspicious? Maybe. Let's just say I hope I haven't made the same mistake twice. I heard about what happened. It can't possibly be true. Cicero, right? Or, well, Babette probably could have said something too. Yes, I'm afraid so. Bruma was my fault. I understand, listener. Now let's forget the past and get back to business. Yes. Thank you, Nazir. Okay, let me tell you how my last job went and then this one has to go find Inigo again before he gets bored and starts talking to Mr. Dragonfly in public. Alright, it was good to see you! What a crazy jester. <gasps> that reminds me, I kind of want to see before I go. What exactly? Well, he didn't seal it. So, uh... I want to see what the response is. Straight to the point, I see. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, Vex, thank you. We are going to... Uh, what was it? Right? White, white run. White run. Put right. together an other shipment from Morrowind, Vekul. Looking for anything special. Well, well do it for if some moon sugar should fall into your lap. Ooh. Maybe. That stuff's getting tough to bring across the border, with all the Argolian patrols. Well, if it turns up, I'll be willing to buy. Hmm. Interesting. Mr. Delvin Mallory. I don't know what you're made of. But I've never seen Don't anyone tackle this many jobs without ending up dead or in jail. We got half of Skyrim back under our wing, and the coin started to flow. There, if you're ready, I've got another special job for you. Of course. What is this special job? I want you to head out to Markov and speak to Endon. He's a silversmith. He has some kind of shop there. His father was a good friend of the guild back in the day. But we could really use his family's influence back on our side. Okay, can do. Find me if you're ever looking for some extra coin. I thought I get this done. Anything worth talking about? Um, scroll. That's about it. Okay, away we go. Uh, so Markarth and White Run. Well, that will be an easy, an easy uh, couple of things. We go to White Run and then we go to Markarth. Uh, we hopefully, hopefully, do not freeze along the way. Do we take in go? That is the next question. I think so. Uh, and it is snowing still some more. Mm. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. What? Let's see. Here. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Pardon me? What do you have for her? What? 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 Hmm. Uh, oh! I keep forgetting to give that to the Archmage. Uh, oh well. What was this? North Queen's Prayer 15th evening start. Today will be a day of thanksgiving. For the good harvest, for a mild winter, for all of the clerics who will be providing services for half off again. 
Spend the day in prayer at your local temple and remember to give thanks to those who have done much for you. Thank you, Ingrath. Beautiful Actually, I think we're a little late for that. Yeah. Oh. Over here. Missed it a little bit. Oh, that reminds me. Where have I got my... Okay. Riften? All are welcome at the Temple of Mara. Mm, not very religious, Khajiit. Working at the Riften Fishery is tough, but it puts some coin in my pocket. Ah, here we are again. Any new messages? Nope. Okay. How's it going, Inigo? <laughs> what is on your mind? Eh, not much. How are you doing? I am okay. Oh, well, that's good. How is everything with you? Doing good. Good. Let us talk of other things. Actually, I. Uh, any thoughts? How how is how are things here? What is going on in your in your brain? I'm thinking you are a good friend. Oh, thank you. Okay. Now look, Inigo, we've got some jobs to do. I've got to go to Whiterun and Markarth. Would you like to come with me? I was getting comfortable. Oh, okay. Uh, we, well, we don't have to leave right now. I don't think. What time is it? Hmm. One of them is a special job for Delvin, so maybe we should get on the way f uh, soonish. Is Iona around? Is she out at the market? Is she down here somewhere? <coughs> uh, oh, she is downstairs. Okay. So we will not speak of Delvin too loudly. Alright. Let us go. You know, I probably... Should have done something like... How are we doing? Mm. I have determined that Creek Cluster does not like to grow in the cold. Anyway, I was going to say... Have you been drinking out here? Mm. Doesn't matter. Oh, something along the lines of... Uh, We should probably get going before uh, it gets too much later, uh, so that we can make some headway. Hello, Shadowmere. I don't think there's frost. I don't think we got followed back to uh, Solitude the last time we went out. So should be good. Let's go. Uh, like this. <laughs> zoom zoom. Oh, we're taking the same road again. I think that would have my hide. That's okay. I'm actually... Ooh, I'm actually not sure how... Which one is being the most lucrative at the moment? The, uh... The market stall or the, uh... Actual sneaky business? Okay. Sun is getting low. It gets low so fast in the winter. It's only it's only like five ish. Okay, now who's Isol? Let's say you wanna go, we do it, we, 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 we go in with the thing and and leave. It seems seems reasonable. Excuse me. It is hello. It's late enough in the day that I don't think it's worth it to put up the stall as a distraction. 
We should probably just do the thing and get out. Hello, John. Okay, do me a favor. You want to talk? Uh, do, do you want to talk? Whiteron has some of the best air in Skyrim. There is a subtle dog breath aftertaste, though. I've noticed that too. Okay, so I need you to go ahead. Ask away. Yes, I need you to uh, just linger around here if you happen to see Isola. Distract her, please. Okay, come and get me when it is time to go. Yep, it should be shortly. I just need to find her. Uh, <laughs> Um, kid. Oh, there she is. Okay, I need to figure out where. Uh. I hope she's not actually going home. There's the Hall of the Dead. Hmm. This is the Battleborn Manor, right? Yeah, I think so. Oh, this is nice. This is going to be a uh, scary. Uh, let me guess, I have completely lost track of where I'm going. As if Skyrim well, didn't have enough outsiders. Now we've got mercenaries from Hammerfell strutting about. You're really salty about the fact that Kino was a thane here, aren't you? Salty Nords. Yes? No, uh, do not you! <laughs> oh, <laughs> scary. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, damn it. Alright, this is going to be interesting. Need something? Nope. I'm just waiting for a friend. In the goal, please distract her. Oh, come on, come on, come on, we gotta be speedy. Speedy, speedy, speedy. Go, 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 go. Is on your mind. It's time to go. Yes, let us go. <laughs> okay, all right. You have you have the right of it. We have to come down. Oh, she's. Oh. Uh, I don't want to stay here overnight, uh, just in case. Let's go. Is that cat's eye you are carrying a lucky charm? What are you looking at? I'm not afraid of you. Uh, am, am I? Carrying. You uh, are my elder. I think so. I work with my mother. Promise you'll sell fruits and vegetables. It's fun most of the time. Yes. <laughs> Salty Nords. Not you. Ooh, okay. Yeah, I like to carry around the the shiny boys. The the, the little the, the little, 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 little. My accent has tripped me. The the little uh, the gems, because they're shiny and. Uh, why would you like it? Is, is that what you were? You want to talk? Thinking about. Mm, anyway. What's next? Next is Margarth. We are going to be riding in the dark, which is never fun. But oh well. Oh. 
good job. Imperials. Didn't most of them go home for the week there? Or am I imagining things? I might be imagining things. I didn't know. Oh, it's snowy. Look at all of that snow. It's gonna get cold. Do I have a torch? I hope I have a torch. I have a torch. Okay. So that way we will be slightly warmer. And uh, we can see. Not like Kajit cannot see in the dark, but still. Oh, hey, we go. Zoom, zoom. Alright, uh, what are we trying to find? The silver smith. I'm assuming. Doot, doot. Oh, ah. Kick to the bucket. Oops. Good evening. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. We are looking for. Come on in. I'm going to take my the torch silver. away. Go away. Go away. But Ian has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Thank you. Uh, actually. Just here to drink. Okay. This is the Silver Blood Inn. I'll let you figure out who owns it by yourself. Of course. I would actually like to uh, rent a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Okay. Thank you. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Uh. In the go. How are you doing, my friend? I'm doing good. Would you like to go with him? Make sure you know where the room Ask is. Ask away. Yep. Good idea. You should take a break too. You deserve it. I probably should, but I've got business, so you know. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Hmm. There's no shipments coming in, so I do nothing. Just drink. Mm, of course. Uh. Uh. Excuse me. Are Are you? I work silver, like my father, and his father before him. Good, you are the person I'm looking for. My wife Kira runs our jewelry stall in the market. Uh, Delvin Mallory sent me. Oh, thank goodness. I wasn't sure where else to turn. Just, uh, start from the beginning, but keep it, you know, down on the low side, because... Oh, hey, I see Mawiri over there. Anyway, uh, continue. Several months ago, I ordered a special silver mold from some artisans in Valenwood by way of a Khajiit caravan. Oh. Well, it never arrived. Later, I found out that it was robbed by a group of bandits led by someone named Regal Strongarm. And why do you need the guild help for that? Look, I talked to the Jarl, the steward, the house car, everyone. They all told me their resources were spread too thin right now. Oh. Word on the street says that the Thieves' Guild is coming back into its own in Markar. Sure. So I figured... Is any thief to steal back what was stolen? Exactly. Look, this mold is irreplaceable. I'll pay you well for its return, and I can also prove to be quite a valuable ally to the Thieves' Guild. Okay, no time to lose, then. Yes, indeed. The only thing I can tell you is that the mold was taken to the bandit's hideout, a small cottage called Pine Watch. Pine Watch? I'm not sure how many men they have inside, but I trust that won't be an issue for you. Good luck. It is... I have silver to bend. Pine Watch is all the way in. The Falkreath. Okay, I need a strong I'm drink. I'm gonna be a silversmith one day, like my mother and father. Oh, good for you. Hmm. I need a strong drink. And the snooze. This is the Silver Blood Inn. Yes, I know. I'll let you figure out who owns it by yourself. I actually don't know that. Okay. I'm looking for the other for the little drink. Blah, blah. Let's save that appetite, hmm? Yeah. Sure, I can afford it. Remember, ale is cheaper than blood in Marco. Mm-hmm. Y yes? Nope. <sighs> I hope Inigo uh, minds himself, enjoys himself. I kind of was expecting Ingra to be sitting right there, honestly. You have you have it happen one time that a random he just shows up out of nowhere and then you expect it no matter where you are and what is going on. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I 
head does not like when I go to bed on an empty stomach. Oh, the hangover is real. Eesh. Don't like. Don't like it all. There's a cynical. How are you doing, my friend? Yes, my friend. All right, let's go. You lead, I follow. Yes. We're going to Pine Watch. There's no ship in it now. Hmm, Beaver. Ooh. Oh, look at all of this. Oh, it said mm, evening stars, is not? Must be getting ready for Saturnalia. <laughs> what am I gonna get you? Hmm? I don't know. I, I actually don't know. Ooh, that's a pretty sunrise. I don't really know what to do for Saturnalia besides stay home and not to work for the guild. Are you coming? Yes, he is. Oh, away we go. Uh, away we go. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Ah. Uh. Do you think the Imperials maybe have some battle mages in Skyrim? There he is. Ooh. This place smells like funky magic. Okay. Faster steed. Faster. Uh sorry, I'll slow down a little bit. This one thought there was supposed to be a ceasefire going on. Ugh. Trust Nords for anything. What? If I remember correctly, oh, which I might not, find what should be through here somewhere, right? I'm not going to deal with that camp because that probably belongs to that hunter down there. Huh? Ah. Hmm. Oh, wolf. Boy. Oh, for pizza. Get out of here, Steed. We have trouble. Get out of here, Steed. We have trouble. No, we have just the one wolf. Gosh, it is just clumsy with her fingers today. All right. It's a good thing we have to take on some bandits instead of pickpocketing somebody because I don't yourself, think I could do it. It's also a good thing I decided to come to to bring you with me. Oh crap, there we go. Dun, 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 dun. There we are. Pretty much. How are you doing, Shadow Mirror? Okay. Okay. Oh. All right. What can I do for you? You can watch. All set. You can watch my back. Frost, you stay here. Be a good horse. In we go. Oh crap! Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh, there's a lot of stuff in here. Mm -hmm. There is indeed. But we are focusing. Like focusing people. I'm going to... Take my cloak off. So that it does not drag on the floor. Oh! Got the card this time. The right card, the note has been sent and we will see how they respond. In the meantime, we will keep breaking down this stuff. We'll keep selling off the wood to keep our friend if we can keep good... Blah, 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 blah. 
We'll have some wine for you in a bucket behind the shelf, consider it a bonus. Re he said regal, but it looks like it's supposed to be a rider to me. Oh well. Strong arm. Give me that gold. Hit the button. And there it is. Uh, well, I was, excuse me, trying to do that without dropping wine down the places, but oops. At least it wasn't all of the wine. Didn't make as huge of a noise as it could have. Which would have been bad. Hello. Oh, hello. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Hello. You like poison's a good idea right about now. Oh, stop moving. I guess I was just hearing things. He. Guess you were. Give me a second and I'm going to. Search them on the way out. Because right now, I don't want to get into any more trouble than we are already getting into. Hello? Oh, it is so dusty in here. Where the battle? Okay. Sneaky man. Oh, you just came down. Okay, I see. I see what you did. Oh, do, do, do. We got lost. We may have gotten lost. Oh. Careful, let me go. I got him in the eyes, I don't think he could see us. Right, we're looting on the way out. Mm. I make so many rules for myself. That was that was a good couple of shots, I think. I think that went well. That was not sloppy. Give me a so what do you need? Wait here for just a second. I will be here when you return. Okay, I'm not going far, I just want to... Not quite. 
Wait, they really uh, pulled out all the stops on the construction there, didn't they? Waiting is boring. No kidding. Shall we go? Yes. Yes, let us go. You look like you've... Yes. You look like you've got something on your mind. What's going on in there? Mr. Dragonfly is being stealthy. I am proud of him. Ah, <laughs> uh, which way? Which way? Which way? This way, I think. We're going to get stuck and turned around again. But that's okay. Aha! Oi! Huh? Screwed up. Oh. Go to sleep. Shit. Oh. <gasps> this place is not very welcoming. No kidding. Thank you for your assistance there. To be fair, I did screw up that shot. So, uh, yeah. That one's on me. I tried to tell him that he wouldn't get past the traps, but he wouldn't listen. It was a stupid plan, and now Regal is so mad she won't even let us cut him down from there. Aye, and she's added more traps now as well. A moment of silence for his fallen friend. Something. Target down. Holy cow! Nicely done. That was good aside from me stepping on a bear trap. We are looting on the way back. 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 So it is regal. Out of poison. Okay. We go for this one now. Don't step on the traps. Don't step on the traps. Step on the traps with our furry little tail and get squished. I'm not nearly as much of a, a poet as you are. <laughs> Are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? Oh, Azure, are you okay? I am a bit sore. Ow. Okay. Oh, okay. You rest for a little bit. Ah. Uh, I'll tell you what. You wait here. Mm-hmm. Wait. I will wait and watch. Okay, I will go see if I can't uh, take on this next bit by myself. Just a little bit. If I need help, I know where he is. I'm going to run my furry little tail right back over there. Uh, 
That's going to be regal. That is going to be that regal. I can't believe that actually worked. Do 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 do. Okay, I think I think we're good. Wrong. Want to do this? Okay, we're good. What is on your mind? Uh, what's on your mind? Are you doing okay? Mr. Dragonfly thinks that we would be lost without him. He is getting cocky in his old age. <laughs> Are you ready to proceed? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> yes. Let us go. You always know how to cheer, uh, how to cheer me up. Especially after you've gotten hit within... Oops, I took your shoes. That's fine. Within an inch of your life. That scared the crap out of me. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We've gone the wrong way. Pop, pop, pop. We're looking for a silver thingy. Yeah, 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 yeah. And she's dead now. It doesn't matter. Do 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 do. Ha 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 ha. Uh, of course. I almost didn't get hit by any of them. Ugh. Okay. Oh. There are so many traps. In the face. You ever gotten hit in... Have you ever gotten hit in the nose by a big ol' and wasting? Oh. Okay, now I'm getting sloppy. Okay, screw it! We're going. We are going... Hello. Back. To Markarth. I can find my way out again. Um, that way. Uh, back to Markarth and then back to Riften. Oi. So many traps. So many poison. Bad. Bad, 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 bad. And uh, where are the And what might. Come on in. The Silverblood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Thank you. There's no shipments coming in, so I do nothing. Just drink. I have the mold for you. I work silver, like my father, and his father before him. Uh-huh. I hope that this gets put to good use because I nearly got poisoned within an inch of my life. Granted, it was my own fault, but still. You've more than proven that the Thieves' Guild is back on its feet in our city, and earned every bit of your reward. Thank you. Tell Delvin that he can count on me to provide the influence around here with the right people when he needs it. If you're ever looking to sell any illegally obtained merchandise, I'd also provide my services as a fence. It's the least I can do. I would appreciate it if you kept your voice down, but thank you. When you get back to Riften, tell Delvin this new arrangement's working out quite well. Alright, we'll do. We're on our way back right now. In fact, let's go. Yes? Nope. Uh, there's just as much to do. I wasn't expecting to 
have to run all over the place in order to do her things. Where's Shadder? Uh, the, where's Frost? Where did we leave Frost? Hmm. Oh, I forget. You have some kind of teleportatory thing on Frost. Hello, Zakuda. The Norse call them Masur and Zakunda. I call them June and Jode. And I never remember which one is which. <laughs> Oops. So I just call the little one Sekunda whenever I see it because it's tiny and cute. Like me! I'm actually quite like the. Eh, you'll catch up. Tool the flagon. I was going to say, I'm actually quite proud of how the put wears he. You know. Eh, that's fine, he doesn't really like it down here anyway, so. Yeah. I hope no one saw that. It's one thing to say you've got the skills to be a thief. It's another to actually use them. No kidding. All right, uh, Vex. Steal anything worth talking about? I have completed the burglary job, in fact. You did the job and you did it clean. That's all we ever ask. Enjoy the gold. Thank you. Anything else? I handle the burglary, shell, sweep, and heist jobs. Most of them involve breaking and entering. If you don't like that kind of work, talk to Delvin. He runs the more up close and personal jobs. Uh -huh. I don't want to do anything. Any uh, well, anything but fishing. Any any shell. I'm 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 in a trouble making wood right now. Let's do it. This one angered someone pretty high up in the keep. Can I count on you to get this done for me? Uh, perhaps. Is it a favor for Maven? Whatever. Just get it done. Here's the job. Thank you, Vex. Now I heard the go and I don't know where crap he went. Hi. Meanwhile, Mr. Mallory. Well, I never thought I'd see the guild this way ever again. A place is great into what it used to be when Gallus was running the show. Oh. Contacts are springing up all over. And I've got young footpads beating down the door to join up. Really? I've got one last special request of you. Finish this one, and all of Skyrim's ours for the taking. Okay, what is this? We actually got a request from one of the most powerful families in Whiterun. The Battle Balls. Oh. Make your way up there, and look for Alfred. He says he's got a matter that requires a delicate touch. Oh, good. And I suggested you for the job. Don't make me the fool and let me down. All right? All right. Uh... uh I've actually finished the uh, Marcarth job as well. I hear Endon's quite pleased to have his merchandise back. Yeah. He's a powerful ally in Markarth. Should help the guild regain a foothold in the West. Success means the guild is getting stronger. We've picked up another merchant and a new recruit. Oh. Being a thief is like a second skin for you, ain't it? Meh. Never seen anything like it. If you don't watch out, you might even earn Vex's respect. That'd be something, eh? <laughs> it wouldn't be. Alright. What's the matter? Afraid of getting your hands dirty? Nope, 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 nope. Alright. I'll be back then. Need something? Nope. <laughs> I might gain Vex's respect if I don't run into any more signposts. What the crap? I hear Inigo. I don't see Inigo. I'm very confused. We have... Inigo? What the crap happened to you? Are you... He has gone invisible? Okay. In the goal, that's very creepy. 
Okay. Are you sure you have your uh, your little invisibility problem sorted out? You want to talk? I, I I don't have an invisibility problem. This place is like a sensory enema. Okay, I don't know what that means. What's next? Next we have to find Alfred, the weird guy with the voice. The 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 all that guy right there. Excuse me, Alfred. Alfred, patron of the great clan Battleborn. A name I'm sure you know well. Uh -huh. I wouldn't be able to get that name out of my head anytime soon. Anyway, uh, Mr. Mallory sent me. The Delvin one. You're here, and not a moment too soon. If anything should happen to Arn, there'll be hell to pay. What? Who is Arn? A close friend of mine. We fought together on the battlefield for many years until old age got the better of us. Now it's up to me to save him one more time. This time, from the executioner's block in solitude. Huh. Solitude. Interesting. I've actually got a job up there, but why am I here then? The city guard in solitude is seeking on for a serious crime. When he fled here... He was arrested for drunken behavior. Can you imagine? Fortunately, his identity isn't known to the authorities in Whiterun, so there's still a chance to save him. Okay, just point me to the prisons and I'll see what I can do. Hold a moment. This is more than a simple prison break. I want to have Arn's name stricken from the record books permanently. I'm setting him up with a new identity. It's the only way to throw the guard permanently off his trail. You know, you're pretty sneaky for an old guy. What's the job? The job is twofold. First, steal a letter that was sent from Solitude warning White Run's guard to be on the lookout for Arn. The second is to change Arn's name in the prison registry to his new identity. Sounds easy enough? If it was easy, I would have hired a local thug instead of a professional. You see, both of these items are kept inside Dragon's Reach. And they don't allow visitors inside the Jarls or the steward's chambers. <laughs> One more thing. If you get caught, I can't afford to be connected to you. Remember that before you do anything stupid. Oh, don't worry about me. You watch yourself out there. I'll see what I can do. Well, this is uh, turning out a little bit better than I had hoped. Let's do this. Ooh, cause she gets a little tired though. Eh, it's fine. All right, just like normal. Yes, my friend. You uh, hang around here. I am all ears. Yep, and I will go do the thingies with the stuff. So that it, and it's just going to be me. So that. Yo, you we, people don't look at the big blue cat. Okay, I will unwind a while. All right, enjoy yourself, Mr. Inigo. That mm. sapling you recovered means the Gildegreen will live again. Your deed honors the people of White Run. Who, me? I didn't do anything with it. Okay. Fine. Uh, I, in fact, did not have anything to do with this big, beautiful I tree. work with my mother sell fruits and vegetables. It's fun most days, but hard work. I am pretty sure Kinawa was the one who did this. And also pretty sure she would have a heck of a time with that guy. Isn't the north? Hmm. Okay. I probably should have asked him about the things with this stuff. Oh well. I have a scroll of Shroud Walk and Nocturnal's Blessing. I think I'm going to be okay. One of them is in the Yard's Quarters. And one of them is question mark. Do 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 Hmm. 
Why are there so many kids? Okay, that looks like the prison registry right there. Okay, there's that. Then... Yard quarters? Quar quarters? Mm -hmm. Okay. And now we go. Oh shit. Way out down there, so we're just gonna see. <laughs> I wonder if that god recognized me from uh, other sneaky business. I have been recognized before, usually around Falkreath. Not a moment too soon. Go quietly, calmly. Now we go. Okay. okay quietly and calmly. So rise up, rise up, children of the empire. Where's Ulfrid? Where's he? No, where's he? No. What is on your mind? Eh, we go. Yes. No. When we are not adventuring together, of course. Do you think it would be a wise move? Uh, we'll talk about Ling Ling later. Things. You lead, I follow. Yeah. Right now we need to find... Ulfrid. Patron of the great clan Battleborn. A name he's sure we know well. Let me know if you see anything you like. Ah. Uh, okay, there he is. Watch what you're doing. <laughs> Old friend. No patron of the great clan <laughs> Battleborn. <laughs> A name I'm sure you know well. Absolutely, I totally wasn't just quoting you outside. So everything is everything's done. It was just a clean little sweep. Uh, Arn should be safe. Like Arn is, uh, and here you go. Here's the things. Arn? Never heard of him. <laughs> I guess that means you're finished. Here's your payment. Tell Delvin that he has my support and all the weight it carries in Whiterun from now on. I think he'll be quite pleased. Okay. If you have need of Thank you very much. You watch yourself then you've come to the right place. No kidding. Okay, back to Rift and we go. Because holy crap. All over the place. Alright. Oh, she is new. Oh. Ooh. It's looking nice and prosperous down here. Nice. Alright, where's Delvin? Delvin. 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 It's probably in here. Alright, uh, what is going on? What is going on? Hello? Is everyone standing around in a circle? This one is confused. 
Hey, Delvin. I think it's time we make this Guildmaster thing official. Go and talk to Brynjolf. He's making preparations. What do you mean? Where is Brynjolf? Um... This one seems to have lost track of the brain. Of brain. Where's the crap? Is Carlyle here? No, nope. she's probably still with the, uh, the place with the stuff. There he is. Okay. Hello, Brynjolf. Well, my friend, the time's come to make it official. It's time to become our guild master. Don't worry. I promise this will be short and sweet. If you'll just meet us in the center of the cistern room, we can begin. That's why everyone is in there. Okay, let me take my coat up for this. There we go. <laughs> I am the tiniest guild master ever. But that doesn't matter. What matters is that I'm good at my job, no? Sneaky and speedy and good at making coin. Oh. And it has the fuzzies. <gasps> the the, the Carlyle is here! Where did you come from? Out of nowhere. Sneaky. Sneaky Look, piggy. I've never been good at these things. So I'm just gonna keep it short. Being Guildmaster means more than just getting a cut of all the loot. It's about being a leader and keeping this rabble in order. With that in mind, I propose that the position of Guildmaster should be yours. Delvin? Agree. Sure, why not? Carlyle. Absolutely. Everyone is in agreement. So all I can do now is name you Guildmaster. And wish you good fortune and long life. Now everyone. Get back to work. <laughs> you are not kidding about it being short and sweet. You need anything. Anything at all. Don't hesitate to ask. Is that really it? There's nothing else to it? Well, that's it. Sorry if it isn't the ceremony you were hoping for. But we're not exactly known for throwing our coin around. Yeah, that's fine. After we're done, head over to Tanelia, and she'll set you up with your Guildmaster armor. Ooh. Oh, and one last thing. Here. I want you to take this. It's sort of a tradition around here. Oh, thank you. What the key is? What is the key for? Mm -hmm. Also, hello, Carlyle. We haven't spoken in quite a while. I can't think of a better person for the job, Nightingale. Thank you. How things have been? How have things been now that Mercer's gone? I'm feeling a sense of inner peace. Something I haven't felt in a very long time. Instead of being clouded with thoughts of revenge and retribution, I feel only serenity and fulfillment. Of course, I've been also dabbling in my old pastimes as well. Take a look around, and feel free to share the fruits of my labor. Well, thank you. Uh, I'll continue having peace and, and fulfillment and whatnot. It was good speaking with you again. Same. Oh, look, we've got banners now. Oh, shiny. Guildmaster test. He's very tired. <laughs> tired of running around. Oh, jeez. I just realized in a day ago. Ingrath is going to have a cow. Hopefully in a good way. Hey, Donelia. <laughs> Before we get down to business, I've got something I need you to do. Okay, what? Well, as you know, the guild's growing and things are looking up around here. The only thing we're lacking is a reliable way to transport our merchandise across Skyrim. Oh, how can I help? This one is very good at being speedy. I'm not sure if you've noticed, but there are several Khajiit caravans that travel across the realm. They're shrewd traders and don't mind getting their hands dirty. I've bartered with their leader, Rasad, on more than one occasion. Oh, you want me to talk to Rasad? He's actually a good friend of mine. Actually, I want you to bring him something. 
You see, the caravans are notorious for transporting illegal substances. Present Rasad with the satchel of moon sugar, and I bet my last septum he'll make a deal. All right, I can do that. You'll find Rasad with his caravan group. Just don't do anything stupid when you get there. So now the pupil is the bolster, eh? Good shot. <laughs> All right. Here's to a long and prosperous future. May the guild last another hundred years. No kidding. I forgot almost that Brynjolf uh, said you had some guild master armor for me. Yes, and I'm more than happy to give it to you. Thank you. I mean, look at this place. I've never seen so much wealth down here. You've made us all rich. I, I here did you go. It. Should fit you like a glove, boss. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You'll find Rasad with his caravan group. Just don't do anything stupid when you get there. I'll do my best. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. See, I like my armor though. Alright. That is snazzy as heck. <laughs> you are correct on you, it does fit me like a like a glove. Very sneaky. Very sneaky indeed. <laughs> okay, I'll get out of your hair. Thank you very much. What do you want, cat? That's boss to you. <laughs>